The French movie Trois Dimensions has been presented as an avant-garde premiere at Imagina 2012. It tells the story of 3D technology from the 1980s until modern day, touching on architecture and medicine. Director Guillaume Letelier says 3D technology dates back to the Italian Renaissance. Leonardo da Vinci set the bases for the first system to represent the vanishing point. Today, we use the same type of projection to represent space in 2D. To me, it seemed important that 500 years later, we still have the same system to represent space. This year's event was hosted in Monaco and showcased 3D visualization and simulation technologies. The exhibition was opened by Prince Albert II of Monaco. The latest technologies from around 80 exhibitors from 10 countries were on display. Animation directors, designers, architects and engineers were all in attendance. The use of 3D in dentistry was a special focus at this year's event, promoting technology that can help doctors with their diagnosis. This year in Imagina, you can make an instant radiography of your teeth in color, 3D and virtual images. Why is there a section entirely dedicated to dentistry? People were excited with the arrival of 3D technology in dentistry because this technology is a great help for treatment and diagnosis. German company Serona displayed a system that allowed patients to have a dental crown created within minutes. With just one meeting, the patient would be able to go with the crown. Before, the patient had to come back after a few weeks because the crown had to be made and it took time to be delivered to the dentist. From these dental sketches, I will be able to determine the place for the crown. I will do an optical scan directly in the mouth. That will give me a 3D drawing. And after this, the manufacturing box will create it. This is it. And I will take this to the patient. French company Archie Video presented a detailed 3D map of France that developers say is more accurate than Google Earth due to its capacity to see the remotest parts. The Japanese company Wacom showed its latest tablet, Cintiq, the perfect tool for graphic artists. It enhances the possibility of graphic creations. The advantage is it's a bigger space and natural, high definition. So with a few tools, we can work. It allows the artist to remove material from the model. And in the end, we have objects that are more defined. It's quite fast. In a few minutes, it's done. We can add colors, work to different styles for a picture, animation, and for 3D printing. And in the end, this is what we have, an object that is directly produced as it would. French company Viverdi's presented its latest software designed to recreate the latest news events in 3D. The software has been designed for TV stations who want to immediately show their viewers a graphic reconstruction. Here we see the recent accident of Costa Concordia in Italy.